there. Have a gamble at my noble steed. Have a gamble at my noble steed. <laughs> a few moments later. Finally, I get to play the game as Ellie. No offense, Joel, but you're not on the cover, and I want to play as the person on the cover. I don't want false advertisements. I would have to write a very strongly worded letter if they had fooled me. Oh hey, take a look. It's one of Ellie's side chicks. Yeah, when you're a main character like her, you get tons of ladies. It's not a big deal really. Just another day at the office for Ellie. Nani? Oh my god, look at her face. You can tell she's not used to handling balls. Why is this even a thing? Why are we slacking off? Shouldn't we be doing something important? Some main character shit. Like going on some patrols and killing some bad guys. And it's only partially because these kids seem to be better at throwing the snowballs than me that I'm trying to find excuses as to why I shouldn't do it. Who are these idiots? I was enjoying playing as Ellie. Then all of a sudden, the game decided to bring me to these wastes of space. Oh hey, it's the controversial one. She's probably not even as bad as everyone says. Now I haven't seen the leaks, but she can't be that bad. Everyone is just over exaggerating. No one can be that bad, I'm telling you. She's probably a lovely person. No way can she be that horrible. Bitch, I might be. As much as I would love to show you these two great characters that I'm sure you're so emotionally invested into, I just can't. There can only be one protagonist in this video, and it isn't these two twats. So, uh, when are we going to start actually fighting people? I've been going around like a right dope. We need to be running into some baddies at some stage. The horse was supposed to jump, Ellie. You weren't supposed to get yourself off. Wait a minute. That doesn't sound right. Nope. Oh shit. Wrong code. Here we go again. Slowly, slowly. Oh, you fucking donkey, Dina. Whose idea was it to bring the AI? She just got in the way. Not much has been happening so far in this video. And that's because nothing fucking interesting has happened yet. I hope you run into some. Big ass zombie dog, because so far, the only thing being tested is my ability to search for feckin' scraps. What? No! What the fuck? It's about time something interesting happened to be fair. I was getting worried that I was going to go through the entire game just going, Oh look, more cards! Well, at least now I know what we're doing. It's just like Jojo's Bizarre Adventure. They've got a crew, we've got a crew, and we're going to take them out. They attacked one of our loved ones, so we're going to attack one of their loved ones. It's a bit of a clusterfuck, but we're going to do it. Ellie is basically a Jojo. And I think we have a title for this video. Finally, some motherfucking action. The amount of walking we've done so far is insane. When I look back at this while I'm editing, I'll just be skipping most of it. Alright then, stealth is the way to go. If I was a bitch, I ain't using stealth. If Ellie is going to be the best Jojo she can be, we need to do this the old fashioned way and kick their arse. Ignore that one, that was just a lucky hit. It's Nathan Drake's ring. I understand this reference. The game is kicking up now. Time to fight. You know, the stealthy way this time around. I didn't even mean to get caught that time. Even when I try, I still end up getting into a fight. Good, a fight. Oh my god, I've missed it twice. You what? Twice. Can you believe it? You probably can. But I'm going to pretend that you can't believe it. That I'm actually that's such a good of a shot. 
Okay, I've learnt my lesson. This game wants me to be stealthy, so I will. You won't see me charging in head first ever again. As if I ain't using stealth. Stealth is reserved for those who don't got main character powers. See, I will just get out of any situation because I'm the main character. Dude, they killed my horse. Now how am I supposed to get home? You call that a rescue attempt? For feck's sake, Dina. You had one job. I guess I'll be the one doing the rescuing around here. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Yep, this will fool them. I've seen this work in COD once, so it should work here. This just goes to show that you don't need stealth. All you need is a shotgun. Don't mind me, I'm just here to kill Abby, the Dio of this game. After that, I'll probably go kill the main villain of Ghost of Tsushima, but until then, I'm here for Abby. What's the worst that could happen, right? I don't suppose you would like to hear about our Lord and Saviour, Batman by any chance. Ah, the, the amount of them, why are they all here? Have they never heard of Patrol the Perimeter? God's sake, it's Military 101, lads. I bet ya, you can crawl under this wire. Okay, so a new video, Ellie's dead. So we're gonna make a new video called Dina's Bizarre Adventure. We got our first clue. Now all we gotta do is get past the infinite army all these villains seem to just pick up. I can't believe this. We're running away? This is Ellie's Bizarre Adventure, dammit. How dare they make me do a running section? Eh, uh, Dina, could you move? Dina, please! Oh, for feckin' hell, Dina! You're more hassle than you're worse. How could you possibly get any worse? I think I'm pregnant. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Oh god, no. Don't do this to me. Don't give me a flashback of these two. I don't think I can handle it. It's too sad. The more I see this, the more and more I become determined that Abby needs to go. This level hurts me emotionally. Yep. Abby's a fucking dead woman. Well, it's present day again, and I've left a pregnant woman alone in an abandoned building. Probably surrounded by zombies, but she was only getting in the way anyway. Oh my god. Get off of me, you mutt! Yeah, I killed your owner. What you gonna do about it? I was just thinking. The zombies and everyone else should just stay out of my way. Because I only want, like, seven people. If they just stay out of it, it'll be over in an instant. You're kind and welcome around these parts. Ellie owns this town now. She's like a one-woman mafia with questionable life choices. They should really just let me drive. I've got the platinum trophy for Crash Team Racing after all, so I think it's safe to say I'm an expert at driving in video games. And now he's after crashing us into the ocean. This is why Ellie should have been in charge. Side characters shouldn't be trusted with anything important. They just fuck it up. Another flashback. Are you trying to hurt me emotionally? God damn it. Stop showing these happy moments. I can't take it. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Ah, good evening, my friend. Are you prepared to die? Fucker takes quite a lot of hits, to be fair. Oh shit, I've trapped myself in the corner. Save me, Joel. Oh, thanks. Fuck. My hero. Honestly, I was hoping that would kill her. But you know the saying. If at first you don't succeed, try again with just a little less effort. You call this a puzzle? It's only a puzzle if it tests my ability to use Google. What you doing? Stalkers. Yeah, I hate stalkers too. But I think we have different definitions. It's like playing a deadly game of hide and seek. I hope the others are as bad as this one. 
Take a feckin' hint. Ellie's only interested in one thing, and that's... Jesus Christ, these guys are absolutely relentless. You swore I stole their limited edition Star Wars tie. They're going after me so much. These guys really need to find a hobby outside of being a pain in the ass. You know, in JoJo's you get a superpower if you're hit with a certain arrow and survive. I hope she gets King Crimson. That way we could skip to the part where we kill Abby. I hate the fact that we're using stealth in this section, but I really don't like the idea of being knocked to the floor every time an arrow hits me. And I have a feeling that's what Ellie will do, so I'm just going to use stealth. I'm doing well. I just need to keep a cool head. Don't go in guns blazing. Learn from your mistakes. Nah, fuck this. I refuse to sit back and spend an hour figuring out the best possible route. The best route is the one that gets me there quickest, and if that means going through all these scrubs, that's what I'll do. Using stealth like that is a coward's way to fight. You have no honour. Also, you have stupid hair. And I don't know why I'm talking to you like you're real. He looks tough. I'm sure our battle will be legendary. I actually didn't think he'd die so easily. It's very realistic, but anticlimactic. I genuinely thought he'd eat the bullets. Fucking sucked. Hands up. I've got one question for you, and if you answer it, I'll let you live. But if you don't answer it, so help me God. Do you know the way? Psych! I can't let you live. There can be no mercy for anyone who gets in the way of Ellie reaching Abby the Terminator. Now I just need to get to Nora undetected, so we can settle this once and for all. So much for undetected, it's always good to have a plan B though, and mine is to run the fuck away. It's awfully nice of them to have these conveniently placed boxes right here, so I can barricade the door so they can't reach me. Nora, I only have one thing to say to you. This is gonna hurt you a lot more than it's gonna hurt me. I hope she's ready for the biggest beatdown in the history of beatdowns until I find the others and then find Abby. So realistically it's probably going to be the biggest beatdown for about a day, but still. <laughs> Jesus that was intense, but we're getting there, we've set a good standard for Abby. And let's keep this good fortune going, Abby here I come. It's interesting how that piece of information has upped the ante, I'm getting nervous. Just thinking about finding out. It will be glorious. Or I'll edit it to make it glorious. Either way, she doesn't leave this video alive. Zombies are no match for me. High five. Oh god, it's a feckin' dog. I hate dogs in this game. They're not good boys at all. Which means they get put down. You got to love it when they're stupid enough to let me use them as a shield. Your man should have just shot through this dead chick anyway. May as well have tried to get me while he was at it, cause there's no way your one was going to survive. It's getting beyond the joke now. How many people are in this army? And what has Abby ever done to evoke such loyalty? I'm on a boat, but to be honest, I can't really control it. I'm just trying not to hit anything that will kill me. It's really just luck though. I can't even move it in the direction I want. How is this even working? Ah, Fucking snake rattles me out. Let's go, Ellie. We have places to go, people to eliminate. Whoever made this building should have his degree removed. He did a shit job. Well, look who I just fell into. It's a good thing I have the perfect plan for you. Oh, we're near the end game now. I don't care if the ocean is against me. I will have my revenge. I finally made it. The next goal is to find Abby and finish this. What's with all the dodgy workmanship in this game? Another feckin' dog, really? How many is in this game? Not in personal, doggo, but I have to assume you belong to Abby, so you need to go. Owen. And the girl I don't remember the name of. She's pretty irrelevant to the story, though, so I think it's fine. One down. Two down. Actually, it's three down. Oh, shit. That's kind of harsh.
there's a commotion up there, and if it's who I think it is, my day just got a whole lot better. Abby, it's good to see ya. At last, revenge will be mine! What the hell is this? This video is titled, Ellie's Bizarre Adventure, not Abby's Shitty Adventure. Time skip! The game has pretty much forced me to play as Abby for the past 20 hours. But you know, I'm beginning to think she's not that bad. She has a decent enough backstory, I must admit. However, I've been talking absolute shite for this entire video, saying that I will have my revenge, and that's what I'm gonna do. Also, Ghost of Tsushima is out very soon. So sorry, Abby. It is what it is. This isn't personal, Abby. Ghost of Tsushima awaits. Celebration dance. Let's celebrate this amazing game. It's actually really good. 10 out of 10. Okay, maybe that's an over-exaggeration. Maybe an 8, but still, it's really good. Ah, don't you just love happy endings?